Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice algebra equation x plus 1 times 2x plus 3 times 5 minus 6x times 3x minus 1 is equal to 6. Our job is to find all possible values of x. So let's start. First, to make this negative 6x positive, we multiply both sides of this equation by negative 1. x plus 1 times 2x plus 3 at left hand side we multiply by negative 1 times this 5 minus 6 times x times 3 times x minus 1 is equal to 6 and at right hand side we multiply by negative 1 next x plus 1 times 2 times x plus 3 negative 1 times negative 6x will become positive 6x and negative 1 times 5 will become negative 5 times 3 times x minus 1 is equal to this will become negative 6 now we combine these two terms x plus 1 and 3x minus 1 and we combine these two terms 2x uh, plus 3 and 6x uh, minus 5 so this will become x plus uh, 1 times 3x uh, minus 1 times 2x uh, uh, plus uh, 3 times uh, 6 times x minus 5 is equal to negative 6 now if we multiply this 2x by this 6x we get 12x so we multiply both sides by 4 at right hand side we multiply by 4 so this will become 4 times x plus 4 times 3 times x minus 1 times 2 times x plus 3 times 6 times x minus 5 is equal to 6 times 4 will become negative 24 now we multiply these two terms so this 4x times 3x will become 12x squared 4x times negative 1 will become negative 4x and 4 times 3x will become plus 12x 4 times negative 1 negative 4 times we multiply these two terms this is 2x times 6x will become 12x squared and 2x times negative 5 will become negative 10 times x and 3 times 6x will become plus 18 times x and 3 times negative 5 negative 15 is equal to negative 24 now we further simplify this expression this will become 12 x squared negative 4 x plus 12 x will become plus 8 times x minus 4 times 12 x squared negative 10x plus 18x will become plus 8 times x minus 15 is equal to negative 24 next 12 times x squared plus 8 times x minus 4 times 12x squared plus 8 times x this negative 15 can be written as a negative 4 minus 11 is equal to negative 24 suppose that this 12x squared plus 8x minus 4 is equal to t let 12x squared plus 8 times x minus 4 is equal to t so this equation will become t times t minus 11 is equal to negative 24 
distribute this t t times t will become t squared and t times negative 11 will become negative 11 times t is equal to negative 24 move this negative 24 to the left hand side this will become t squared minus 11 times t plus 24 is equal to 0 now this is a quadratic equation and is factorable we write this t squared and we break this negative 11 t into negative 8 times t minus 3 times t plus 24 is equal to 0 from these two terms we can factor out t in bracket left t minus 8 and from these two terms we can factor out negative 3 in bracket left t minus 8 is equal to 0 as you can see this expression t minus 8 is a common factor so we factor out this t minus 8 and in bracket left t minus 3 is equal to 0 from here either this expression t minus 8 is equal to 0 or this expression t minus 3 is equal to 0 from this equation we get the value of t is equal to 8 and from this equation we get the value of t is equal to 3 now recall that we have supposed we have supposed that 12x squared plus 8x minus 4 is equal to t. We have supposed that 12x squared plus 8 times x minus 4 is equal to t. So when t is 8 then this will become 12x squared plus 8 times x minus 4 is equal to 8 move this 8 to the left hand side this will become 12 x squared plus 8 times x minus 4 minus 8 is equal to 0 and 12 x squared plus 8 times x this will become negative 12 is equal to 0 now if we divide the whole equation by if we divide the whole equation by 4 this will become 3x squared plus 2 times x minus 3 is equal to 0 and this quadratic equation is not factorable we solve it by quadratic formula according to quadratic formula x is equal to negative b is 2 plus minus square root of in place of b squared we write 2 squared minus 4 times a is 3 times c is negative 3 divided by 2 times a is 3 next x is equal to negative 2 plus minus square root of this 2 squared will become 4 and negative 4 times 3 times negative 3 will become positive 36 divided by this 2 times 3 will become 6 x is equal to negative 2 plus minus this will become root 40 divided by 6 x is equal to negative 2 plus minus this 40 is same as root 4 times root 10 divided by 6 next x is equal to negative 2 plus minus root 4 will become 2 times root 10 divided by 6 and x is equal to from the numerator we can factor out 2 in bracket left negative 1 plus minus root 10 divided by this 6 is same as 2 times 3 so this 2 will be cancelled out with this 2 and from here we get 2 values of x 
x1 is equal to negative 1 plus root 10 divided by 3 and x2 is equal to negative 1 minus root 10 divided by 3. Now we solve the second case when t is equal to 3. So this will become 12x squared plus 8 times x minus 4 is equal to 3. Move this 3 to the left hand side this will become 12x squared plus 8 times x minus 4 minus 3 is equal to 0 and 12x squared plus 8 times x minus 7 is equal to 0. Now this quadratic equation is factorable. We write this 12x squared and we will break this 8x into negative 6 times x plus 14 times x minus 7 is equal to 0. From these two terms we can factor out 6x and in bracket left 2x minus 1. From these two terms we can factor out plus 7. In bracket left 2x minus 1 is equal to 0 and as you can see this 2x minus 1 is common so we factor out this 2x minus 1 and in bracket left 6 times x plus 7 is equal to 0 from here either this expression 2 times x minus 1 is equal to 0 or this expression 6 times x plus 7 is equal to 0 from this equation we move this 1 to the right hand side this will become 2x is equal to 1 if we divide both sides by 2 this implies that x is equal to 1 over 2 and from this equation we move this 7 to the right hand side this will become 6 times x is equal to negative 7 divide both sides by 6 this implies that x is equal to negative 7 over 6. So, we get the third value of x is equal to 1 over 2 and the fourth value of x is equal to negative 7 over 6. So, we have four solutions of this equation negative 1 plus root 10 over 3, negative 1 minus root 10 over 3, 1 over 2 and negative 7 over 6.